YouTube and welcome back to the Minion Moto Show. I got another little hangout spot. It's not really a hangout spot, but nice little spot right here underneath this tree. I think it's kind of cool, even so. I know some people would be like, it's kind of weird that you like this tree, but I don't give a damn. The only thing I like about California is all the views that we get out here now granted i can't tell where the damn camera is really pointing at because it's usually strapped to the side of my head but i can point it exactly where i want it to but those are some nice views out that way if you know what i'm you know so but uh yeah my whole thing is, is uh, I've heard a couple of other people talk about this situation. And uh, no, motor vlogging ain't dead. And, uh, you know, I know some people would probably say that motor vlogging is dead, but it ain't. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm doing a lot of uh, daily vlogs right now that have nothing to do with dirt bikes and or motorcycles and shit, but... You know my whole thing is is it's uh i'm still a motor vlogger i'm just taking a different approach to it at this point in time so you know my whole thing is is just because you do regular vlogs or daily vlogs doesn't mean that you're not a motor vlogger and I know Rocket Rider, again, Rocket Rider 510 said something about this, is he's still a motor vlogger if he does regular vlogs. And yes, you are still a motor vlogger because you do, you still have channels or videos of you riding bikes and stuff. All you have to do is just have at least, I'd say at least 10 different videos of you riding a bike in order to be classified as a motor vlogger because anybody can ride a bike once and it doesn't matter but motor vlogging ain't dead i ain't doing this regular vlogs because motor vloggers motor vlogging's dead i'm just doing it because i'm trying to challenge myself to come up with more and more content and even though at the end of the month when i might end up running out of content or however long it is between now and the time i run out of content i'm going back like i'm still gonna have my regular motor vlogs at least every saturday and wednesday at least so yeah it ain't dead so don't let somebody tell you that it's dead and it's a waste of your time because i'm gonna tell you what if you have that passion to be able to do it and you actually get out there and do it and you actually take your time and whatever who cares if you just wing it or if you actually plan it out it doesn't matter that's the good thing about making a video and that's the good thing about you know making video or making videos and riding bikes and everything you don't have to have a pre-plan or whatever you can always just win it but like me i just wing it for the most part but i also plan it out and what i mean by that is is i have at least 15 video ideas written down at any given point and every time i do one like i am right now i always come up with two more at least maybe one other video and uh you know yeah so but just because i write down what i want what the topic i want it to be doesn't mean i have a pre-planned recon recognition or whatever of how i'm gonna say it or what i'm gonna talk about for that topic like I, 
I just looked at my list of what motor vlog or vlogs I want to make. And I seen, oh, motor vlogging ain't dead. I want to talk about that today. But I don't have a script to go off of. So yeah, it's pre-planned while I'm still winging it. So, you know, with that being said, don't be afraid to just do what you got to do yourself happy make yourself grow as a channel and do what you got to do and I'm gonna tell you what no one else is going to be running your channel for you no one else is gonna care about the only time someone else is gonna care about how much you grow is if you grow more than them and you're you get bigger than they are and they're stuck at being a small channel so you know yeah so my thing is don't worry about motor vlogging being dead if someone else tries to convince you otherwise tell them to kiss your behind and walk away because motor vlogging ain't dead but i still get out there and i still do it I still ride and I still make videos while I ride and I still post those up too so you know people ain't gonna people ain't got nothing nice to say about you or about you and your channel or any of your stuff you gotta tell them to kiss your ass and say goodbye so catch you guys on the flip side